Well, uh, Nitex is a global asset management firm, uh, one of the largest in the world, and we have uh, offices and companies all over the world. Um, we uh, manage institutional and uh, assets, mutual fund assets, pension consultants, individual investors all over the world. Uh, so uh, when we saw the Newport Jazz Festival being the grandmother of all festivals uh, and being a global institution and known all over the world, we thought, boy, what a great combination to get involved and engage as a company with such an amazing uh, institution that spreads jazz. You know, um, of all the things, um, you run into different people at certain parts in your life, and you think you um, have your friends set, you know, when you start getting into your 50s, you know. Um, to have met him at this point in my life, and to have someone with such an influence uh, on me already. It's been an amazing experience and I'll, uh, and I'll treat it forever as one of a, a dear friend. So I, I got engaged because of Newport and I will stay engaged because of Newport but also because of uh, George and what he has built. And I think this need, Newport Jazz Festival needs to live on uh, and uh, just in honor of him and what he's been able to accomplish. Uh, it's been a it's been a it's been a heck of a ride, and I'm looking forward to uh, next year, the 60th. That's uh, wow, 60 years of Newport Jazz Festival. It's just crazy. It's, uh, it's been it's been just unbelievably rewarding. It's been amazing, in fact. And I will tell you, uh, uh, just seeing today, this morning, listening to the uh, Massachusetts All Star Band. Yesterday they had the Rhode Island All Star Band, high schoolers. Uh, playing jazz, kicking off both days, and here are these 16 and 17 year olds playing, and then later on in the afternoon you can hear a 70, 80 year old playing, and they're doing the same thing, and they're 60 years apart, and it's just, to me, that is the most rewarding to see this generation just carry jazz, and then this younger generation picking it, picking it right up and keeping it going. It's truly amazing to watch. I think uh, it's uh, an opportunity for a large group of people. You know, people sometimes uh, think of jazz, maybe a little club, go hear a band. Here, you get exposed to many different genres of jazz. Jazz is always evolving and innovating. You got your traditions, you got your people out there on the cutting edge. Um, you've got uh, people from Asia, from Africa, from Europe, from all over the U.S. And what are they doing? They're playing jazz, and they're adding their own instruments, or they're adding their own culture to the music and to me a festival allows for a novice or someone who's spent their whole life listening to jazz to hear a lot of different things over the course of a few days and it's just an amazing experience and to me that's what's great about these festivals it's able to share the global jazz story in one place